Okay, well I see I can pull out uh, a 2 on the top, certainly. And I also can pull out an x. So let me pull out a 2x on top. That would leave me with a 5x here. And it would leave me with a 4 here. And on the bottom, well, let me actually pull out a 2x there, just because I see the 2x dangling so nicely here. And so, in fact, I'll just write this as 2x times 2x. Well, now I see this factor, 2x factor on top, 2x factor on the bottom. I can cancel away. But I'm left with just 5x plus 4, all divided by 2x. So you can see this actually simplifies quite nicely to an identical e equivalent thing, but much simpler to deal with. So that's sort of fun. OK, so I hope you got 5x plus 4 divided by 2x. OK, how about one last one? I'll use a here just to really throw you off, you know. Ooh, a. I can't do it. Can we change the a to x and then do it that way? Sure. Yeah. I can only do it with x's. OK, so here's the problem. Uh, a squared minus 4a plus 4, all divided by a squared plus a minus 6. Factor away and cancel at will.